Hey everyone, my name is Sean Blaster, and I'm studying biomedical engineering at Johns Hopkins University. For this week's Engineering at Home project, we challenge you to complete the STEM Paper Airplane Challenge. The STEM Paper Airplane Challenge is a great way to learn about science, technology, and problem solving. So let's get started. For our Paper Airplane Challenge, you will need construction paper, tape, and a handful of coins. <laughs> There are many ways to fold an airplane, but here's a simple design I went for that's folded in just five steps. Definitely pay attention because this goes quickly. For step one, fold the paper in half horizontally, then unfold the paper. For step two, fold the dog ears from the top left and right corners. For step three, fold the two sides of the paper into the center line. For step four, fold the wing flaps down to the bottom. And for step five, feel free to add a name to your plane. I just finished rereading the Harry Potter series, so I named my plane Hedwig 2.0. Now that you built your paper airplane, let's go test whether or not it can fly. Find a target, like a doorway, to aim your plane to fly through. I'll show you what I'll be aiming for today. Now it's time to test our plane in flight. Just like the best pilots, I'm gonna be wearing goggles. Here we go. I call that a success. If your plane was able to successfully reach its target, like mine was, it's time to test its ability to carry cargo. Let's go add some coins. Now, it's time for our cargo flight. Once again, let's always remember our goggles. Here we go. We invite you to post your flights on social media. Tag the Whiting School of Engineering to let us know you've completed the STEM Paper Airplane Challenge, and also let us know how much your plane can carry. All submitted posts will be reviewed for the chance to be highlighted on our social media accounts and to receive an electronic certificate of achievement. Have fun, and we can't wait to see what awesome cargo airplanes you come up with. 